Sweet, that's just what I said to Mary. This is gonna go really. Um, you're in my chair. That's my chair. I sit there. Oh, well, I just thought that as I've done your job for you, that maybe we could share. Ooh, oh my. Here we go. That's enough. But I am Gabriel, messenger of the Lord, and that's my seat, angel. Well, I'm an angel of the Lord. I know, because I introduced myself that way when I was doing your job. We're all, we're all angels of the Lord. This is a heavenly host. It's what we do. I happen to be known by name. I am Gabriel. And that's my Gabriel line two, Gabriel line two, it's God. Ah, well there you go. See, I, I guess it's just what happens when you're known by a name. <clears throat> Gabriel here, God. Gabriel, I have an announcement to make. It's a big one. And since you did so well with Mary and Joseph, I'd like you to take care of it. I appreciate that, God, but I had a little help with Joseph. I went to Mary and myself, but I thought a little bit of a different touch would be better with Joseph. A little bit of a different touch. Yes, now there's an idea. Yes, that's an idea. You should take them with you. Well, I don't know if that's absolutely necessary. I mean, who gets visited by two angels and I'm your messenger? That's, what's better than that? No, no, not just you two. I mean everybody. Yes, that's it, everybody. Everybody, everybody, yes. Yes! What a great idea! It's the most important news, and you're taking it to the most important people. N why not send everyone? But if it's that important, and it's to the most important people, wouldn't you want to send your number one angel in their finest angel wear? Okay, how about this? One of you goes, gives them the message, and then you can all appear and have a good sing-along for a few minutes, a few hallelujahs, a couple of praise the Lord, um, and maybe a glory to God in the highest heaven. That would be pretty spectacular, right? Oh, I'm liking this. All right, whatever God wants, let's do it. So where are we headed? A major capital, a palace, Canada? Shepherds, Gabriel. Shepherds in the field outside of Bethlehem. Shepherds? Your important people are shepherds? <sighs> Why do I bother? Of course, Gabriel. That's who this is really all for. The poor, the needy, the tired, the broken people, the ones the world has hurt the most. And we're going to change that. They need to know how important they really are. Shepherds, it is. You're right, of course, God. Let's you and I do it that together. We'll deliver the message as an angel of the Lord, and then we'll bring in a gang to sing. How about it? Let's do it. Amen. Amen. Ahem. Hello, angel here. Hey, relax, it's okay, really. Don't be afraid, we've got great news. There's a baby being born that's super special, and you should go and see it. It's nearby, in Bethlehem. Um, thanks. I got, I guess we have sheep to take care of, and it's getting late, maybe tomorrow. Yeah. you. Yeah, you can't expect us to just drop everything and go because you say it. You're angels and somehow good news that another baby's born. 
four. I've got five of my own already. No, you don't understand. This child's important. This is news from God. It's, tell him, Gabriel. I think this needs an official document. Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people, for unto you is, uh, is born this day in a city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord, and this shall be a sign unto you. You shall find a baby wrapped in swaddling, lying in a manger. Cue the heavenly host. <laughs> Bethlehem is that way. Do you think they'll find their way? Should we go help them? Yeah, they definitely need us. Let's go, everyone. Go and see that king. Go and see that king. Go and see the king of everything. Go and see the king. Go and see the baby king. Going to see the king of everything. The end. And then you can. <laughs> In a city of David, a savior, which is Christ, the Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in Mount. And then. No. <laughs>